All right, so we made it here. We're inside. We're just waiting on Joey to show. It's going to start in... I'm supposed to be videoing this show. <laughs> you are. You can do it. I'm doing behind the scenes. But this is everything they have for an auction going on. <clears throat> so they got two tables set up. And I think it's going to start in about 15, 20 minutes or so. <laughs> And again, we're only going to be able to stay here until uh, about 7.30 because he's got to be back by 8 o'clock in order for uh, Mara. She's got to take off at that time. So we'll see how that works out. And Josh, Brittany, and Laura just showed up. Yeah, Hi, look at that cutie. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> Grandpa's here. Yeah. Hi, sweetheart. <laughs> Sleep or something. Instead. You don't need to sleep. We can sleep later when we die. <laughs> he, met, he met somebody earlier and he introduced himself as Big Rich. Okay. And he's like, nice to meet you, Big. Okay. Like, as if it was his first name. <laughs> <laughs> it was funny. Rich yeah, doesn't have a sense of humor. He's going to be able to stay. Uh -huh. At first, I thought his, his talk was at 7. I could okay. stay until 7 30. Okay. My nurse is leaving at 8. I have to get back there. You understand? Yeah. So okay. I'm going to miss the whole talk. Okay. So I come up here to support as much as well, I can. I went out there to work the crowd, said hi to everybody. <laughs> you will miss the talk, but we will not miss you. Maybe walk out <laughs> to the crowd so everybody sees you, right? I went out there and I worked the crowd. I told right. everybody hi. They all, what's up, oh, man? No, in, the, in my book bag, I have notes that I need. you got to save the best for last. He's been doing a lot of filming all over the place. I haven't been able to get really, I mean, and I'm not sticking around at night and partying with him or doing anything like that. So I really don't have a lot of film of Joey. Uh, we'll see what we can get. But again, they're going around right now. They're doing a video on Rich's and Josh's five favorite fishes. Uh, that's what they're doing. Uh, I think he went out and seen another shop this morning. The one we were going to do with Dave got canceled because of time mix-ups. But, uh, you know, hey, it is what it is. But Joey's already been out like yesterday. He took off. And I think like pretty much when we got back from a rescue, a koi rescue, you'll see that video coming up, um, which went really well. But um, he took off and he went to two, two or three other places and been doing filming of different stores and shops and things like that in the Cleveland area and that's why he's here so uh, you know we'll just I'll, I'll see what kind of footage and film we can get today and we have a community service uh, person here today helping out uh, Skyler and him are sweeping up the basement well, uh, this one here, the koi, she spawned and she laid a thousand eggs in here. So we got to do a water change, so I'm going to put the hose into a bot here so we don't suck up no eggs. And we'll do like a 90% water change on her. Uh, <laughs> all right. Man, so we scraped the bottom and got rid of all the eggs. They're not fertile, there's no male, so <laughs> we cleaned that. We're almost down and then we'll start filling it back up here in a minute. Okay, instead of draining now, I got the hose in the Bellagio, and now we're filling, and she'll be just fine now. Get her in some clean water. I'm not sure if it's a different light they stuck on, or the white wood, or the plants, but boy, it looks so sharp in here now. And it looks like uh, Skylar broke her phone, so 
I'm going to give her a ride while this tank over here is filling for the koi. Jerry's here. He'll keep an eye on it while I give her a ride up to get a new phone. And it's the next morning and the koi that we picked up are all mixed in here. And I can see some of them, especially that gray one there. He's one. There's that Japanese one right there. There's that nice butterfly. Another one over there. There's there's nice ones. There's that other butterfly right there. But yeah, he had some beautiful fish. And of course, there's the one with the crooked back. But we say there's two of them actually. That one there and that one. There's two of them. But yeah, they're looking good. Doing good. Josh was over here again yesterday trying to catch that blue one, but Keeps evading them, but they keep trying. <laughs> so it looks like after they did a couple videos here, Joey and uh, Josh took off. I'm not sure. He's doing more things. I think they went to a couple different stores. Uh, we changed the water on the, uh, you know, the um, koi that dropped all the eggs. So we know she's a female, that's for sure. But just going to finish up a little bit here and get out of here and uh, give John a ride home. Alright, it's still a little cloudy. There's still some eggs floating in there. We couldn't get them all, obviously. Uh, Jerry threw a little plucko in there, so he'll take care of some of them. And we'll probably do one more change, uh, maybe later today or tomorrow, probably. And uh, unless she lays a bunch more eggs, you know, that's always possible too. So we'll just play it by ear. Now that they have no bio load in this pool pond, these tanks are staying so nice and clean and clear much much better than it was before there was just too much bio load with all the rays in there and now they're most of them are in the 22 of course there's a couple here there's a couple with the sturgeon and the baby of course is in the back over there but yeah all these tanks just look so and you know we fixed a lot of lights and everything too so that that definitely mattered so all right but yeah it made a big difference all right so i just got back from the store i had to get little dude some food and i picked up some special thread because one of our favorite nets that you've seen a couple times now we've had fish get away from us because it's got one hole and then another littler hole over here but this net is a really really nice net we like it a lot and it's a, a three extender and you can see how long it is now and so it's really a good pond one and uh it's one of our favorites so rich is like you say you threw uh you can sow reap i'm like i can and he gave me this net and i'm like i can do it so i'm gonna go ahead and stitch this up and i'll show what it looks like and uh, we'll save this net instead of having to throw it away and get a new one all right i got the majority of it done there's some little holes like right there there's a little one there was a little one up here and then I got one bigger one and that was done you can tell that was done uh, it was burnt because this is like a nylon and that's what I'm using as a nylon thread as well so this is burnt here but I'll, I'll get it together and I'll fill in some of these little littler holes that are in it and we'll get this net working again All right, I got the two main ones, which is this one right here and that one right there. There's a little one there, but I found a big one right here. So I got one, one more big one, and I'll get this little one right here. And the rest will be fine, and we'll have this net back again. Cool. All right, all main three, uh, the main ones are all done. There's a couple little ones, but <laughs> we don't use this for guppies or anything. It's for big fish. So, it's all good. Three big ones and one sort of little one. But good to go now for, who knows, another year or so. All right, buddy. <clears throat> Hope you enjoyed that. Those are just little clips. Uh, Rich has got some really nice uh, video of... Uh, him behind there uh, talking to Joey and Joey telling the story of exactly why he is at the Medina Aquarium Society uh, doing the speech that he was doing and uh, of course 
you'll see there, there's a video coming up of their favorite fish. I don't know if it was three, five, ten, whatever, but it's their favorite fish. I gave away one. Hopefully, they're not going to kill me. Uh, and, you know, it, it was just a little collage of different things that happened over, you know, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And basically, you know, just little clips, basically. That was it. Had a good time. Um, uh, Skylar's phone, uh, it did break, but, uh, Jean had a phone because she turned around, she's on the phone talking to a, like, salesman somewhere, and she's, uh, talking and saying, uh, all right, he's got a phone there, and, uh, he's got an Apple 8, I can get it for 150, and John jumps up and says, I got an Apple 10, you can have it, 150, so he sold his phone, <laughs> so Skylar got her phone, so that took care of that problem. But as you saw, you know, thing was is uh, Joey was there to do some major work and help with the main channel with Josh and Big Rich, and they got a lot of things they're going to be doing, I believe. I uh, haven't even been told. So uh, you guys will stay tuned. They got a bunch of videos coming up. Uh, in the meantime, you guys hit that like, subscribe, and share, and we'll go deeper with the Reaper.